What's up, broski? Boy, oh boy. Excuse me. Excuse me a second. Yeah. Now that I've brought my channel back to life, more or less, <clears throat> I'm going to start making uh, more wrestling reviews and also talk about the latest wrestling gossip. All right? And we're going to start this off with Corey Graves, broski. Holy shit. <sighs> this guy, bro, he literally dug his own grave. No pun intended. This guy, bro, Corey Graves, is in a fucking shit storm of a fucking drama mess right now. <clears throat> His wife of 11 years posted up a photo of them together on, on her Instagram. She's... She, She's then deleted it because of all the comments she was getting. But she posted up <clears throat> this photo of her and Corey Graves together, all happy, nice dress, and him with a suit and tie with their three kids. And she posted up how, <clears throat> oh, <clears throat> I've been through so many suicide attempts at life, alcoholism, drugs, depression, yada, yada, yada. But what hurts, what hurts the most is to find out that my husband, Corey Graves, of 11 years, has been cheating on me with one of my daughter's role models, which is Carmella. Holy shit. So, yeah. She put her personal business <clears throat> and Corey Graves put it on blast. <clears throat> and, of course, this is the big fucking shit storm of a fest. That's someone like Corey Graves doesn't need. You know? For those of you that don't know, break it down for you real quick. Corey Graves is the commentator on WWE, Raw, SmackDown, and these major pay-per-views. <clears throat> Me, personally, I enjoy his commentary. Some people hate him, but for stupid reasons. Well, not really. I can see why some people hate him, because he does tend to have a big mouth and does come across as a hypocrite. Uh... But I guess most of us are, right? <clears throat> you know, this guy, a lot of people hate him because he gets he gets into a lot of these internet flame wars with these trolls and the rest of the WWE universe, you know, with the fans. And, and he always talks about loyalty. And I think he's even called a Trump out for cheating on his wife. And now, lo and behold, look, this motherfucker got caught cheating on his fucking wife. You know, this guy, <laughs> whatever. But you know what? See, his wife, bro, you could tell that this bitch has a big fucking mouth. You could tell she is probably a nagging cunt. <clears throat> but this bitch acted on emotions rather than on logic. Rather than, rather than use logic and say to herself, hold up, let me think for a second. <clears throat> I should confront him about this personally. And handle it like, uh, you know, adult to adult. Handle it like adults. Instead, she got it caught in her emotions oh, ah, and posted it all over social media. Now, Corey Graves has pretty much become a, a laughing stock on the internet, you know? And all the memes and the jokes that they're making about him are pretty funny. Like I said, you know, she's she, she since then deleted the post that she made about him on Instagram, but you could find it on these wrestling Facebook pages. You know, it's been trending. <clears throat> But you know what, Broski? I don't really blame. I don't blame Corey Graves. You know, think about it. These guys, bro, they're on the road with the WWE. What, like three hundred plus days a year? They're barely home, and they're surrounded by all this hot, young, fresh, pink cunt coming through the doors. You know, starting off on on NXT and then. Moving on to the main roster, you know, you see all these hot young skanks and you being a celebrity yourself, a WWE employee with seniority, you know, hey, these girls are going to throw themselves at you and bada bing, bada boom, you know, your cock's going to get hard, you know? So I don't blame Corey Graves, you know, Carmella's a pretty hot piece of ass, you know? Young, fresh, ditzy from Staten Island, you know? Nice pleasure hole. Doing dance breaks with our truth shaking her ass. You know, you're going to get, you know, you're going to fantasize. <clears throat> so 
So for Corey Graves, it, it was either, you know, sticking his cock up Biggie's uh, sweaty booty o's or Carmella. What would you take? Obviously, you would take Carmella, you know? Uh, yeah, what else can I say about this? These WWE superstars, bro, that's another thing. I don't understand why they get married at all, you know? These guys aren't going to be home. You know, they're, they're gone 300 days out of the year. And what about their wives? I'm pretty sure their wives, are, they're also doing their own thing as well. Oh, hey, honey, it's me. It's me, a, a, a Big E. Uh, you know, I'm going to be in Afghanistan doing the booty old dance for uh, some jihadis at the Saudi Arabia pay-per-view. So I'm going to be gone for a couple weeks. <laughs> booty o's, booty o's. You know, his wife, now that, she, now that she has that information, this is just an example, by the way, you know. Now that she knows that Big E is shaking his ass for men in Saudi Arabia, I'm pretty sure uh, the, the, wife, the wife or wives of these wrestlers, they're going to go get their own side piece. You know, who's to say, you know, it hasn't happened. I'm sure it, it's happened many times. But that's the life of a WWE superstar. That's why I don't recommend these guys get married, you know, just have fun. <clears throat> these WWE superstars, broski, you know, these guys travel from country to country. They're, they're all over the world. <clears throat> and as a man, you're going to get tempted when you, when you see these groupies. You know, when you see all this, uh, all these fresh young girls in their early 20s just literally throwing their pink fucking cunt at you. You know, think about it. You're a WWE superstar. You just worked the nice show in, in, in Tokyo, Japan. You got three days to kill, you know, because your next fight doesn't leave for like a, another couple days. You know, you're at the bar, you're drinking, smoking. You know, a Japanese girl recognizes you, she wants your autograph, and then before you know it, she wants to suck your big fat Yoshinoya cock. So yeah, I don't blame these WWE superstars, you know, as a man, you're going to do what, you know, what excites you, what pleasures you. <clears throat> but yeah, now this guy Corey Graves broski, now his wife, let's get back to this, instead of talking about Yoshinoya's cock. <clears throat> Now his wife has all the evidence she needs. She could take it up to a judge. And this judge is going to see, you know, adultery. This judge is going to see that he has three kids, a wife. And guess what? I'm pretty sure Corey Graves is now going to pay up the ass in child support and alimony to this big mouth cunt, bro. This big mouth bitch just caused all this fucking drama. So, I'm pretty sure Corey Graves now, he's royally screwed financially, you know? <clears throat> and he was the breadwinner of his family. Because what, what does his wife do anyway? I, I don't know what his wife does. Just a stay-at-home mom or something? You know, she's going to need finances now, and it's going to come right out of Corey Graves' pockets. About a good fucking 60-70% of his bank account is going to be gone. <sighs> it is what it is, broski.